Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swoosh, and I'm reviewing Toll, which was a bullish gap and very tough to trade today. It did turn out to work. Uh, it was a bullish gap. It rated good enough to go long. It was 22 points. It was hard to trade, though. Why? Because the first setup failed. The second setup held and worked, but you had to stick with it a long, long time. Many of the shorts that I do go right away in the first 30 minutes of the day. I rarely go long, but every once in a while, there are not any good shorts, and there's good longs. And in this case here, toll worked, but it did take more than one trade. Some people did this, got stopped, retook it, got out with profit. Some people never put a stop in, which is not what I do. <clears throat> Those people ended up making money and never taking a loss. Okay. Some people took the stop and, and never got back in and didn't do the retake. And some people took it more than once and ended up profiting that held it all the way through into the lunchtime. The stock ended up going all the way back up to the high, not going over it, but trying and almost getting there. Time of the day was 1230. And it's two o'clock in the afternoon, the stock held and it could go back up to the high of the day again, it could go over the high of the day. Next target is 3460 and then $35. And it's got two hours left in the calendar day it could still go and do it. But for those of the people that held through it, when it went back up to the high and didn't get over it, that was the exit. So Galahad was here with me. I was help mentoring him. I told him that he could do the ad if he wanted to here when it triggered on the 15 minute, right at 1115, he did. Cost average was positioned down and he ended up being down in the day and originally in the morning and then making $450 profit on the day. So he made the money he was down back and he was up $450 for the day. So he had a good day. It really takes conviction when something doesn't go right away, so to stick with it. By right away, I mean between 9.30 and 10. What allowed me to have the conviction in this? The gap rating. The gap rating, the system that I know, uh, the way that the stock was acting and trading, it was not selling off hard, but lots of traders love to do gap fills. It does not work. If you were short this today, you would have had a scalp to make money. It never had a smooth downward move. It never really broke, never broke the low really, and didn't have the smooth short move, which many of my shorts do. The, the bullish move was smooth, but it took a long time. It took until after 11 o'clock. And usually, like I said, I like to trade in the morning and be done. Bullish gaps take longer to go to targets than bearish gaps because panic comes in to a stock and selling happens faster than buying. That is one of the reasons I prefer to short, but there wasn't really any good shorts today that rated per my system and this gap was a bullish gap and it rated so boom this was the call and it worked but it took till the late late morning so for those of you that were there today in the room i got a couple emails from people that held it through and made money on this congratulations some people didn't put the stop in in the morning never took the loss and obviously made money in it if you took the first trade and didn't do it again that was fine one loss isn't going to kill anyone Everyone had different results in this today. So it'll be really interesting to see where this goes tomorrow, but the stock looks definitely higher. And if it doesn't get to 35 today, it should buy tomorrow. This is a real bullish gap that will follow through and continue. It will have a continuation move. Good luck, everyone. If you're interested in more information on the Golden Gap course, email me at melissaatthestockswish.com. I decided to, to do the next class in March. Change of plans here. I've got a very heavy schedule with a lot of things going on. So the class dates are going to be March 4th and 5th for the next course. And uh, if you're interested and want to sign up, I am running an early bird special through Friday of this week. Email me at melissathestockswish.com for more information. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.